All righty. How's it going, everybody? It's Paulie back again with another sketchbook recap installment. All right. So last week, I think I went over. Yeah, I went through a um, sketchbook tour of uh, this sketchbook. And so you already know this is completed. So let's get this out of here. Um, but what I wanted to showcase mainly today is just like the different little pieces that I've been working on ever since uh, last week, Saturday. So I've been doing a lot of, if you haven't checked it out already, the short that I did of um, this Ahuhu uh, sketches process, you know, go check it out. I've been doing a lot of these like little portraits of, uh, you know, older black women with um, some interesting faces and everything like that. Interesting uh, shapes to their faces, sorry. And yeah, just been trying to capture that with these artist tiles um, from Strathmore. And it's been pretty fun so far. Um, this is going to be a future um, Copic uh, portrait. And it's going to be a commission as well. Or it is a commission, rather. So, yeah. So I drew that yesterday. And so... With um, this sketchbook being completed, I started a new one uh, that I had for a little while and uh, had a few sketches in. Um, it's a Strathmore drawing soft cover uh, sketchbook and it works pretty well. It's pretty cool. Um, I'll get into what I'm thinking about with this project, but uh, or this uh, sketchbook, but Here's what I did like a couple, I think sometime in 2022, like early to mid 2022. So here's the first page of, you know, getting back to the sketchbook. Started it on the 1st of February. And yeah, so it's just a lot of the same old, same old, just a um, whole bunch of figures, a lot of wrestling poses, they're fun. <laughs> Uh, the face there. Let me get this out of the way too. Um, hey, yeah. Uh, so more of those like figures and everything like that. This is the craziest pose ever. I'm so sorry for that. It looks wild. It did. Uh, I, I don't even. I can't even explain it. But anywho, so this right here. I don't know if you guys could tell. I'm sure you can. This is a uh, pencil over here. So this is like just black ballpoint pen over here. And on this left page, I've been uh, trying to do more pencil stuff. So I know you guys haven't seen much of, uh, you know, pencil work from me or pencil drawings. And I haven't been using pencil much, but I thought it'd be fun to just revisit it in this sketchbook. So my plan is right. Um, and then we just got more sketches over here of like some future projects that I'm working on. My plan is to, um, I'm so proud of this. I love this so much. Like I did this during class, ballpoint pen, so cool. Um, but yeah, so the plan is to do this whole side of the sketchbook, like the, the right side of the sketchbook, all in pen. And then once I'm done with it, you know, I'd be on this last page, doodling whatever, right? I'd flip it upside down or like flip it whatever way and just work backwards until I get back to the beginning of the sketchbook or at least this page. Yeah, this page, which doesn't have any drawings on it um, or, you know, pencil drawings on it. And then, yeah, just experiment that way, you know, just first have the like have the first half of it be pen you know on this page and then on the next be pencil you know i just wanted to i don't know tackle sketchbooking in a different light it's a, it'd be fun to just try and execute um so yeah that's the plan for this so this is like the next page that I didn't show you guys yet so Just got some doodles of some characters and everything like that with a pen. 
than uh, notes on a sermon. Not too long ago, yeah, the fifth, last Sunday. Um, so yeah, then more figures, um, some sketches. And then I also started a printmaking class at school and um, yeah, just been trying to do that kind of stuff. Just sketching more in this uh, part of the book, do more doodles and stuff not close to reference at all. You know, just trying to work from imagination more. Uh, as I say that, I turn to a page where this is nothing but um, reference stuff. It, 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 there's no shade on, you know, using reference at all i think it's vital to all of our um progress as an artist you know what i'm saying but uh it's also fun to just play around like this is not from reference at all i get all start this sketch started from just this guy's head and then like i just built off of like this arm then had him like just doing his goofy pose while he's just looking there with a stale face you know like i thought it was funny so yeah, we got some other sketches for school projects and then yeah, some more sketches from imagination. All of them are like super fun to me. I feel um, we got some like angry dude that kind of looks like Robin for whatever reason. Then some mannequin figures, guy buried under whatever sand. And there's like a little storytelling, some like people in a Jeep, maybe making their way to like a Waffle House. I don't know. Deserted Waffle House. Well, yeah. Um, and then some Bengal character guy. So, yeah. Um, and then just exploring more of that kind of stuff, like, you know, trying to tell a story maybe with this like little boy character. Is he magical? Is he possessed? Who knows? Um, yeah, and then also just looking at my hand as reference and then just quickly sketching it out, you know? So, got a lot of that going on just to fill space. Got some characters. Looks like this like purple, blue, and green palette. Um, looking at like uh, some Pinterest boards for like fashion. Like I want to get better at doing like full body uh, figures, you know? So there's that. And then more of that, more fashionistas, you know? Just, um, yeah. Cool stuff. Always cool to just stick a post-it note of reminders on what to do the next day, you know. Uh, yeah, just more characters. Sketches of some uh, Bengal tigers. Um, more figures wrestling. <laughs> They're so fun to just draw, you know. Um, little thumbnail sketch of like an idea of some sort yeah um but yeah this is all just this week you know just trying to sketch as much as possible fill up the sketchbook because I, I i already explained this before but i love like just filling up sketchbooks like i think um i'm this much done with it I, th this is not a good comparison, but you know, yeah, got this much left. So I think I'm doing pretty well within only a week of it being done, you know, so, but anywho. All right. So we also have this page that I did not too long ago. Um, all right. So we have this page that I did just yesterday. I believe I did these sketches in the morning while I like class and then 
I did this at night, just the last night, actually. And uh, yeah, like last night, um, I was with my friends and we were just, well, we were on the phone with one another, all my friends. And uh, we were just trying to do um, like little prompts, like throw prompts at one another and just uh, see what everybody came up with, you know? So like, just trying to chill and draw with one another. I think this one is like, you know, draw a sea creature, an undiscovered uh, sea creature. I like how this came out. I don't draw creatures that much. I don't even think I'm good at them. Um, so yeah, I like how that came out. And then this was like, you know, draw something hatching out of an egg. I don't know. I drew like a, I don't know, a sapling taking masks or making masks out of people's faces. I don't know. <laughs> but, you know, and then these were just this morning. Just chilling. Um, sketching around and yeah. So that was, that's what I've got for this sketchbook. Um, but yeah, got that going on with this. And then I just wanted to show, um, this sketchbook, uh, that I've had for a while. Got a lot of, well, not a lot, but like, I got some paintings in here. Like if y'all want me to do a tour of this one, I, I could, or once I'm finished with it, obviously, but but yeah, just a whole bunch of uh, Copic portraits or, but yeah, just a whole bunch of like Copic uh, illustrations in here. But anywho, um, I recently, this isn't, these two aren't recent, but um, I've been recently doing uh, some, you know, uh, painted or uh, acrylic portraits in this sketchbook. And um it's a Stillman and Burn uh, sketchbook. I don't know where the like little leaflet thing is, but uh, yeah, I've been sketching a lot of like just uh, portraits in here with like acrylic. Uh, I really like how this came out. I did this like uh, Wednesday and it was just super fun. And I did this one as well. Uh, I tried to merge like this one photo of like this lady and like her looking up with like some of like Jill Scott's features. You can't see it because I didn't really do the best job, but it was just fun. You know, I did this one before these two, but uh, yeah, I just had a blast with painting these and I think I'm going to do more painting uh, kind of videos, you know, so yeah. So, so these were the sketchbooks I've been working in. Um, just been trying to play it around with different mediums, you know, paint, drawing, and obviously markers. So yeah, that was this week's sketchbook wrap up or recap, if you will. Uh, yeah. So thank you guys for watching. Have a good one. Catch you later. Bye-bye.